you know, we were all blown away by this. So tell us what happened. It was the middle of the night. Yes, it was the middle of the night. I just, I just opened my eyes. I was in a lying position and um, I just saw him. I saw this angel. Right next to your bed? Yes, right next to my bed. He was kneeling right next to me. So his face was not too far away from me at all. In physical and form, in he physical was that form, close to he you? He was that close and he had his arms folded like this. He had a, a white garment on which were, had a sleeves to the mm -hmm. short sleeves. He had very blonde curly hair and piercing blue eyes, beautiful. Mm. And I've referred to him afterwards as my beautiful angel. And then um, I sort of awoke myself a little bit more and at that stage I screamed ah! and he vanished. <laughs> <laughs> very, very stunningly beautiful. I can't, I can't... And you said he had wings. You saw the well, top of the wings. Yes, I thought, yes, I, I thought I saw the top of the wings just, just because he was in that position. Mm -hmm. I felt so, I could see just here what I thought were wings. Yeah. So how old did he look? Oh, he would have been young in his 20s. In his 20s. And what, what kind of expression did he have? Oh, a serene, beautiful expression. It was so serene that it completely, it was like peace. It was as if he oozed serenity and peace. Wow. How do you feel about the fact that you've, you've actually seen in bodily form an angel? <laughs> I felt extremely privileged. I've not seen him since, yes. but very, very recently, a couple of weeks ago, I, I invited him back again, but he, I haven't seen him in that same form. But I was in the same position again, and all I could sense was this, this glowing, um, misty gold. And it was fleeting again, just just say five seconds. Mm. But it was enough to make to make me say, "Well, good night, beautiful angel," mm. and I fell straight asleep. That's awesome. Peaceful.